cute people. I'm at my back door <laughs> or my terrace door or patio door, whatever you want to call it. And look how nasty it is. I don't want to go out, but I'm going out today because it's Monday. Yeah. And over the weekend, I had suggested something to my son that I wanted to eat that I had seen on the Queen Latifah show. Oh, oh. But it's an old classic favorite, and that is grilled cheese with tomato soup. And she had someone come on the show and cook it, and it looked good. Now, they made their tomato soup from scratch. I don't think I'm doing that. It didn't take much to do it, but I want to be quick and easy. Then, a couple of days later, Bethany, I watched her show too. Yes, and she also made it herself. I think on Queen Latifah, they made it with bacon, and that's what I'm going to do. So over the weekend, I was try I went to the store to pick it up, but I couldn't. You know, sometimes you have problems with your ATM card. I, don't, I didn't have it exactly. I was a dollar short to get the stuff, but I didn't know that. But that's another story. And it's two days before Christmas. I ain't cooking nothing for Christmas, so we just going to eat whatever's in the hall. So I'm going to... I always start a video and I'm going to take you guys along, but I never end up doing it. I start it, but I never finish it. So I'm going to finish this one. So we're just going to go to the Scuzzy Pioneer near my neighborhood. And then we're going to go to Dills. I'm going to show you some of the stuff that I'm going to buy for us to eat for the next two days. You know, nothing special, but I really want that grilled cheese with bacon, honey. And maybe a slice of tomato with some um, tomato soup. So let's see how this is going to work out. Look at the rain. It's so healthy outside. But it is a joyous time of year because it's two days before Christmas. So I shall be back. It's a scuzzy, scuzzy pioneer. If you know where I am, tell me where is I? chicken you do clean it even though Dr. Oz is saying that you don't have to clean it but oh it looks so nasty in the soup aisle I'm trying to find some tomato soup I see tomato basil over there which one do I want I'm not sure I should get the vaccine now and want that one with this regular tomato soup. Oh, there's tomato soup. That sounds good, right? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. That's all my stuff. You see, I got some beer. But life is good. And I got my tomato soup. So let me get out of here and go to deals and get some cheap snacks. Alright, I'm finished shopping out of 
Scuzzy Pioneer, which wasn't too bad. Now I'm on, on my way over to Dill. No line now. Gotta hurry up. See tomato basil and dills, which I believe their soups are a dollar. I just bought the same soup from Pioneer for two, no, three damn dollars. You know I'm pissed. Oh yeah, I'm gonna buy them right here from Dills. And then I'm gonna take my butt right back over to Pioneer, which I don't really feel like doing today. Take these suckers right back. Yes. Yes, I am. I am that girl when it comes to saving some ruler. What? Are you kidding me? That's $2. That's $4 saved. I need my $4. I went back to Pioneer and they took it back. I told the lady, y'all got it for $2.99. Bill's had it for a dollar. So I thought that they were going to say no to be smart and then I was going to have to tangle with it. Well, okay, forget all that. Ain't no need to be ghetto. It is raining like crazy. No, they like crazy. But it's raining and wet enough. This is part of my neighborhood. Two days before Christmas, y'all. Look what people are wearing. I don't know what the temperature is outside, but it is not wintry cold. Let's see my mail. This is all the food I got. See my food. Tell y'all feel old Bessie to the tippy tippy top. Look at that. Nasty floors. They probably thought this was cute, but it ain't cute once that gets dirty. Whenever I go shopping, I always make sure he's home so that he can lift up the baggage. I'm ringing the bell. I left my cell phone in the house. He's not answering. And I don't hear any footsteps coming down. Here he comes now. I'm going to kill that child. He probably had them headsets on. Listen to our conversation. I was ringing the bell. What happened? What happened? You had your headsets on? Yep. I knew it. Ever had him have this one you can't hear? Who are you talking to? Making a video? Kinda soda, but you're not in it. Don't worry about it. I did a in my day. Watch me get around a little bit. Oh wow, really? Yep, I sure did. And I got your feet in the video. My grilled cheese. This is um two with Goodness, what's on here? This is mozzarella cheese in here with bacon. Then over here, I have two other ones with three pepper. I forgot the name of this cheese. Oh my gosh. Three pepper cheddar cheese, three pepper jack cheese, something like that. Mmm. -hmm. And over there is just a little bit of tomato soup with basil. I told you they did change it at um, Pioneer. So I was lucky there. And to grease up my pan, I used parquet. Yeah, man. So this is what I have been dying for all weekend. And so far, it's coming together. I like it when a plan comes together. And so let me tell you. When you buy 100% whole wheat bread, make sure it says 100% whole wheat in the ingredients, not enriched whole wheat. Because if you buy enriched whole wheat, you may as well eat white bread. So, this meal was delicioso. Tastes so good. I wanted to vlog my day, but I think I did a terrible job of vlogging. But I'm still going to post what I did. I could only get better with time, the rain, trying to lug and pull and shop. It ain't easy, but it was fun. And I always look for fun things to do. So, 
I just want you to know that I really enjoyed my meal. And try not to eat white bread. I haven't had white bread in a long time, but it probably would have tastes so much better with white bread. You know, things that are bad for us taste so good. And if I don't speak to you guys again before Christmas, I would like to wish from my family to yours a very Merry Christmas. And I mean a very Merry Christmas. Today here in New York, I don't know what the temperature is, but it was so warm. Tomorrow we're supposed to have snow, so I don't know what tomorrow is going to bring. But I will say, I hope I'm in this frame. Lord have mercy. I don't know why I think you guys are looking at the top of my head. Yes, I know my hat is all over my head. I have on a stocking cap. I never took my hat off because I really don't believe in putting hats on a table. But here I have my stocking cap on. So, like I said, I don't know how much of me you can see. But I really, really would like to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Yeah. It's important to me to say that. Because Christmas is a time to give, to share, to love. And I'm all about all that good stuff. I got some evil things in me too. If I really would have vlogged today like I wanted to, you would have seen me and my mean self today. My mother said, you say, you're so mean. I try not to be because that does not get you any closer to the creator. And I'm not trying to impress anybody but the creator. So I gotta watch my um, little mean girl ways. No, that's not true. I'm not a mean girl. One day I'm going to explain to you what I mean by what I just said. But it is definitely the season to be given, so I hope that we all do that. And not just commercially, but give from your heart things that you cannot buy, like love, compassion, understanding. Just trying to give back to your community if you can. Anything so simple. Oh my God, I feel so bad. I was supposed to get some information to somebody about um, volunteering um, for the holidays and I didn't do it. Oh my God, I feel like the worst person ever. But I'm going to send her a message and apologize because she probably really wanted to really, really do some good this year. Well, for the holiday, I should say. But um, if you watch this video and you know what I'm talking about, you know who you are, please understand I am so sorry. I forgot. I really reminded myself to keep on top of it and forgot anyway. And Christmas is like in two days. As a matter of fact, maybe I still can get the information to her if she can't volunteer for Christmas or maybe she still can because I was going to but I won't be able to. So if she can't do it for Christmas, she can do it at any time because volunteering um, helps anybody all the time, anywhere, right? So, okay, I'm just hoping I don't have tomatoes. That meal was so good, y'all, I'm telling you. If you don't want to be standing around um, your stove, your oven all day for a nice meal, make this. This is going to be one of my great comfort foods. Somebody can ask me in one of the videos that I did, what are some of the foods that I like? This meal right here. Yes, I love it, love it, love it. <laughs> But who doesn't love um, cheese and bacon, right, and butter? I get, like, add all that and still had whole wheat um, bread. So I did something good just to have something so bad, and it was delicious. But I was wishing you guys a Merry Christmas and, you know, what I think of the season and all that stuff. But listen, I'm going to go because I want to chill out and just relax. Yeah, pretty much just chill out and relax. So I want to thank you all for stopping by and watching this video. Hopefully I'll see you in the next. I want to wish you and your family a very Merry Christmas. I don't speak to you guys before then. And I want you to share and spread 